In this tutorial, I'm going to show you how to post a blog to your WordPress website in under five minutes using YouTube. So one of the great things I love about YouTube is there are a lot of videos out there already that have been made that people love and that you can use and share on your website. So what I like to do is I like to go to YouTube and I like to search um, some of the big guys out there and see what they have. One of the ones that I love is Lowe's. So you can click on Lowe's and you can come here and click on Lowe's Home Improvement. Your yard has been slumped. And you can see they have this great channel here. And if you click on videos, you'll see they have tons of cool videos already created with do-it-yourself projects and home interior things, home exterior um, tips, things like that. So lots of cool stuff in here. Also, another one that I like is Home Depot. Sherwin-Williams, Pottery Barn, these are just a couple of different ones that you could use. So um, in this case, I think what I'm going to do is I am going to use the Sherwin-Williams and I'm going to go use five simple tips to add color with confidence. Or you could even do, for instance, 2015 color of the year. There's, and you may want to also make sure that you are using a post that is relative to what's going on today. So here's one that says color inspiration for spring. So I think actually I'm going to use this one because it's spring right now. So I'm going to go ahead and click on this. Okay, important to watch the video because if it isn't relevant then you don't want to use it. So we're going to go back and I think we will go try something different. Um, we're going to go ahead on the right hand side and we're going to click on most popular so I can see what other people have liked and that way I can see what's already been popular so if I post it to my wall it's going to tell me that other people are already have loved this video so I know that it'll be popular on my website as well. So maybe how to paint stripes on your walls. Let's try this one. Okay, so I've already watched this video and I know that it's a great video. I'm going to go ahead and pause it right here because it has the title of the video right here on my screen and I'm going to use my snipping tool. On a Mac you can use the snipping tool on a PC or the snip tool rather. You can find that in the Apple um, App Store. It's called Snip. On a PC you use snipping which will be down when you go ahead and press the start button on your PC. Just type in snip. It usually is already installed on your computer. Most people just don't realize it and you'll find that it does the same thing as what I'm about to do. So I'm going to go ahead and capture the screen and I'm going to grab just this part of the image and snip that. Now I'm going to go ahead and copy the title to this. I'm going to go over to my snip and I'm going to rename it for the title, only just the main part of it. So now I have a graphic to go with my blog. Then I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to log into my WordPress site. Now in this portion you're going to log into your WordPress site and you're going to go to posts and you're going to click on add new which is here or here. Then I'm going to go ahead and paste my title right into the top and then I'm going to come down and under this section, I'm going to make sure I'm on the text tab. And I'm going to go back to the video. And right underneath the video, you're going to find this section that says share. So I'm going to click on share. And then I'm going to click on embed. And lastly, I'm going to click on show more underneath because I want to make sure under show more that I have show suggested videos when the video finishes unchecked. And then I want to have show player controls and show video title and player actions checked. Then here under video size, I can change the size to fit whatever it is that I want um, the video size to be. So when I know this is right, I'm going to come up here and grab this. And then under this text section, I'm simply going to paste that code right in there. Now, the other things that you want to do are you want to come over here under categories and you want to choose your categories. So in this case, this is home improvement. Um, I also want to do a, a category that is 
interior projects. So interior projects. And it will automatically check it for me. And then I want to go ahead and post um, this to the blog in this case as well. So I've got three categories chosen here. Under tags, you can add some great tags as well. Tags, you want to keep them between one to three words. So interior painting tips. Um, let's see. Painting stripes. Paint techniques. So look up your um, tags. It's important to kind of research this a little bit and make sure that you kind of know what you're doing. If you're not sure how to use tags and categories, then there are some useful um, links on wordpress.org that you can look up these this information. Also, you may want to check your video library on the left-hand side. If you have a video library, check in there. Or if not, I'll post those links in the bottom of this video down here. So. Okay, once I've chosen some tags and some categories, I'm going to go down here to my featured image and I'm going to go ahead and upload the image that I just did. There it is. How to paint stripes on a wall and I'll choose that image. Once it's uploaded, I'm going to copy the title and I'm going to paste it into the alt text and the description and then I'm going to set featured image. Then I'm going to come up here and I can either publish my post immediately or if I want I can schedule this. So I could schedule this for another day. Matter of fact you can go in and create tons of these posts and schedule them so that you have a post every day of the month if you want. So scheduling is a great um, way to have your blog work for you and automatically do the work. You might spend an hour one day creating these posts and it'll work all month for you. So I'm going to go ahead and schedule this for tomorrow. I'm going to make it at 6.58 in the morning. People are very active on Facebook and social media in the morning. So I'm going to make it for, I'll make it for 7 a.m. And then I'm going to go ahead and schedule it. And then what this is going to do is it's going to post it for me on April 30th at 7 a.m. Now, some of your blog posts, you'll also have different options depending on the theme that you're using. In this case, um, this option is a little bit different. So I'm going to show you another way to do this. And in this case, I'm going to go to Pottery Barn. And I am going to choose, let's see. Easy home decorating ideas. All right, so I'm going to go ahead and grab my graphic again. And I will copy the title. and rename my image. So I have my featured image. I'm going to come back here and I'm going to go ahead and post the title right here. And in this version, we have an option over here called Format where I can change it to Video. And I'm going to go ahead and choose a couple of categories. Then I'm going to grab the URL. In this case, I only need the URL of the video, so I'm going to click up here in my URL bar, grab that, come back here and YouTube, I'm gonna click and post it right in here. I'm also gonna hide related videos and auto hide the YouTube logo. So those are the only two options I need. Add a couple of tags, set my featured image. There it is. Okay, once that's done, I'm going to go ahead and grab the title and paste it in the alt description and text, and then set featured image. 
I'm going to come up here and I am going to schedule this. And I'll go ahead and hit schedule and that's it. That's all you have to do. So that's an easy way on how to post a blog to your website, schedule it, set it, set it and forget about it and easy ways to find some great channels. Again, I like to use Pottery Barn, Sherwin-Williams, uh, Lowe's, Home Depot, there's also Benjamin Moore. And don't forget that while you're on one of these videos, to check out the ones on the right-hand side, and you'll see even more um, related videos. You might find a great channel that has some really good videos there as well. Um, you can also check out on YouTube, when you go to the main YouTube channel, you're going to see um, related videos to what you like, but you'll also see some of the more important, popular videos that people are posting as well. And if you watch these, you'll also see some really cool ones that people already have liked and what's popular. So you can check those out. And if you have any questions, feel free to give us a call. Thanks for watching.